Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And a lot to be excited about because coming up for you, action from Liga. It's Lorient and they take on Troyes. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Well, it looked as though they might be in just for a second or two. The attack looks promising. And he cuts in from the wing. Real chance. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. And a short corner, let's see. Accurate ball and draws the near post. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, here it is again. And they go short just to get a different angle on the cross. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Ugbo. Ripa. Good technique displayed. Now delivering that deep cross. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. Quentin Boigard. Well, they couldn't keep it. Ugbo. Chavalera. Florian Tardieu. And that pass could be troublesome. A really top-notch piece of defending. Laurent Abergel. Le Fay. At times, they make passing look easy. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Eric Palmer Brown. And the ball with Kouame. Palmer Brown. Romini Kouame. It's with Shabalava. E.K. Ugbo. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Moncondui. Moving the ball forward with purpose. 
Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Well, he was very keen to give them the advantage, but instead it will be a free kick now. And the referee might well have been tempted to book him for that, resisted the temptation. Potential danger here. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Ike Ugbo. Robbed them. Kubulong Mendes. Abergel. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Space and time for the cross. Takes the shot. And the keeper stretching to deny him. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And he takes it on. Chevalera. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he's certainly got his team back into this game with that goal because up to that point, they hadn't played particularly well. I think he's had a decent first half, but he'll be looking to build on his goal in the second 45. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Montcondui still passing it around with authority but then the one that fails to hit its target it will be claimed by the keeper Lefay Moncordui. Well, they'll be happy to have regained possession. Kouame. And on to Ugbo. Renault Ripar. And players waiting in the centre. And he dealt with that ball played in rather well. A very good tackle. Dangerous looking attack. Will it happen for them? Nicely saved. Well, as you can see from those stats, they're just not creating enough. They need to play at a quicker tempo, get the ball into the danger area and get more players in the box. Make the opposition have to defend it. Really a very poor ball. Tardieu. And the ball with Kouame. And the referee has awarded the free kick. He tried to play advantage, but it wasn't forthcoming. And perhaps a bit fortunate not to be shown the yellow card. Different story next time, no doubt.
And they will make the change now. goalkeeper would be disappointed if he didn't save that twenty minutes to go in this one Ugbo it's with Shavalava gives it a go making sure it didn't get past him and take it away Could be threatening. And, with, and danger still. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Who can he pick out? Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. A dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider Le Fay well we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one on the attack in the closing phase Fabien Lemoyne and he read it well defensively Well, nearing full time, and here's the question. Are they going to come up just that little bit short? Stuart, your thoughts? Well, if they want to get something from this game, they need to... Could be! Excellent save. Well, you're absolutely right. It's a top-quality save, but they're running out of time here. And over it comes, and that's a high-quality stop. Well, it may not count for anything, but that was a great save, wasn't it? And he's fired over the corner. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. But the goalkeeper angry with himself here. Well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't spill it into a dangerous area like that.
So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Waga. Laurent Abergel. Real chance. And a goal to tighten things up. They've thrown themselves a lifeline. Well, here it is again. And just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Yes, Derek, there was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, no doubt in my mind, he was the best player on the pitch. And the main reason they won this game, he was brilliant.